it's a big uh, uh, a big red fish with vegetables let's watch Therese Today we're going to be making baked red snapper with vegetables. Let's come back and see what's going to be going into our dish today. Now let's talk about what's going to be going into our dish today. Let's start off with the fish. I got my red snapper last night, cleaned it up and cut about halfway into the fish. I then marinated it in a mixture of a pinch of salt, bouillon cube, white pepper, habanero hot pepper, onion, green onion, leeks, red pepper, green pepper, ginger, garlic, and country onion as it is commonly known. Let's come back and talk about the vegetables that are going to be baked with our fish today. We will bake our fish with some potatoes, green pepper, red pepper, onion, celery, and broccoli. We will add our broccoli about five minutes before we take the fish out of the oven that way it stays crunchy. Cut your vegetables in manageable chunks and then spice with the same mixture that you spice your fish with. We will also be making a pepper sauce to go along with the fish. That is optional. Here are our vegetables all cut. I am mixing in the same mixture that I used for my red snapper. I am also going to add about a tablespoon or two of uh, extra virgin olive oil. That way it keeps it moist. Once I do that, I'm going to put it at the base of our pan. I will be doing it in aluminum foil. That way everything stays uh, moist. I will be broiling the fish today. I have my oven going at 350 degrees and that's where we're going to keep it at. We will be cooking this for about 30 to 40 minutes. Let's come back and see what the oven pan looks like and then we'll throw it in the oven. This is what our dish looks like at this point. I started off with the vegetables. I put them at the bottom of the oven pan and then put the fish on them. We are going to completely seal the aluminum foil. That way it keeps it moist. 15 minutes into baking, we're going to check how our fish is doing. At that point, we will baste the fish if necessary. Five to 10 minutes before we take the fish out of the oven, we're going to open it up. That way we can give our fish a little color. Let's get this going. Well folks, we are all done. Our dish is ready to be eaten. Whoa, doesn't that look mouth-watering? Today we made oven-baked red snappers with vegetables to go along with our optional hot sauce. I cannot wait to dig it. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Remember to like us on Facebook at Cooking with Therese and also subscribe to our YouTube channel Cooking with Therese. Remember, eating healthy does not have to be boring. Bye-bye and see you next time.